Hi everyone. When I finished up the tags the other day, I promised everyone a flip of the whole little fall journal. And uh, one of the things that uh, I have decided is that the ties are almost not too long because this is pretty full. I might take this one off just a little bit, but uh, yeah, maybe. Let's see here. But I'm going to do a journal flip of, yeah, I think, I think those ties need to come off just a touch. There we go. And uh, then I'm going to do a journal flip of the little fall journal. But it, it ended up being quite chunky um, once I got all the tags and tucks in it. And so we're just going to flip through. I'm going to center it up here a little bit. And um, these are all pages that you saw me do. In the top loaded pockets, there are tags. These, and I made some little tucks. These are just uh, coffee dyed cardstock to go with it. In this little pocket, I put just a little folded piece of paper. And then I made with a piece of the leftover cardstock and some leftover coffee dyed paper, um, I just made a little notebook. And in this spot, I have some of our paper that we put a little um, fun leaf on. This one's got a leaf too. I'm not going to open all these papers in the next few because, um, and then we've got a uh, another tuck and then there's another tag and in this one I put a folded paper and this one again I've got papers I've got a couple folded papers and then this is a just one of the cardstock ones that I cut out in the same shape as our um, the dictionary page, the ones that were made from the file folder. Sorry. So we have those. I love this double spread on this page. And there's more coffee guy about dyed tucks and tags. This little pocket, um, I made some just some little these are cardstock and they're just little folded pieces of cardstock. with a little piece of folded up paper and this one has another little folded piece of cardstock and you see I, I just used all my little pieces of cardstock and a folded paper I don't know if this one has I think yeah it does it has a little leaf on it I put a leaf on most of them. And another file folder shape cardstock tag. And this is my page with the ribbon on it. I really like how that came out. I like the washi. This is still my my most favorite page of the whole book. Very simple, but 
and a couple more tags and tucks. And on to our last page where we have another couple of cardstock, folded cardstock pieces. And another tag. Um, now I put this one in this way. Okay, go back in there. Partially because then it shows from the back. So, so that is my little fall journal. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you had fun watching all of the different pages. Now I get to put it all back together, right? I hope you had fun watching all the different pages. It really came together. It was a lot of fun to do. Um, I, I almost think I'm going to do another little uh, book like this but on a different theme. I haven't made up my mind yet though because I have some other things I want to finish up and do before I um, before I start one of these. And I'm going to uh, get ready to go here and I wanted to read you a quote from the 1000 ways, 1001 ways to creativity. Creativity as has been said consists largely of rearranging what we know in order to find out what we do not know. Hence, to think creatively, we must be able to look afresh at what we normally take for granted. George Kenler. Ken Kenler. Kenler. Um, I like that. We must be able to look afresh at what we normally take for granted. So guys... Have a wonderful afternoon. Enjoy your day. And I hope you're having fun. Make some art. Bye-bye.